My job entails kind of two parts. One is to do exhibits that are educational to the public, and so their um, information needs to be accessible to the public and our collections need to be on display for the public. And then the other half is to make sure that the collections are safe and well utilized, so I'm in charge of making sure that if there's an earthquake, that skulls aren't gonna roll off of a shelf. Within the biological anthropology subfield, you can be a primatologist that studies primates. You can be a paleoanthropologist that studies human evolution. You could be a paleopathologist, which is what I am, that studies um, disease and trauma and bone. Human osteology, which studies human skeletons. So you can have that specialization within biological anthropology. We're here on this earth to experience everything that we can. And so if it's something that's gonna influence other people's life, that's wonderful. But if it's something that's going to just make you happy, that's wonderful too.